Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name's Katrina. If you're new here, I'm currently outside with my dogs. They'll probably get tangled and I'll need to deal with that in a minute. But I thought I would use this opportunity to take you guys on a house tour. If you didn't watch my last video, I announced that Nick and I just moved. We're doing a uh, rent to own with this house. Uh, behind me that you can see and um, I thought we'd just show you around we're not officially moved in like officially unpacked we still have a few boxes kicking around um, but if you are watching this whole video make sure you're mentally prepared for real life this is not cozy and glossed over and everything's not picked up we're gonna pass laundry baskets and I'm sure my dishes are to the max right now <clears throat> so if you're interested and you want to hang around and see the house tour stay with uh, stay with me and as soon as they are done going to the bathroom we're gonna head inside all right friends i figured we would start this tour outside since that's where i am that's my big old minivan this is where i park this is hercules to not moving come here buddy buddy come food this is my front step going up into my house. Oh, pop, stop. Sorry, they just had me super tangled. Come on. Come. My little flowers, my little pumpkin. I'm going to be doing another video here soon about decorating for fall. Normally, I would have that video up, but we moved instead. So the first room that we come into, as you can see, is our kitchen. This space is really nice. It has a lot of windows, which is something I really enjoy for my plants. And as I said, friends, well, this is real life. I got plenty of disses. And we're not officially moved in, so yeah, there are going to be like this box here bag over here but we'll get there so we came in we went to the right and this is my kitchen if we went to the left pups are very confused on what's happening <laughs> we go into the living room and again a couple more boxes hanging out <clears throat> but another great space with lots of windows and a dinosaur we've got some of our wall decorations up at this point not all of them but some of them real life laundry basket couch looking like a hot mess <laughs> this couch is actually pretty new to us we're still breaking it in but it's kind of a neat couch. It came in so many different pieces. I actually saved this so that you guys could see it if you are interested. This furniture came in several different pieces, like six or seven. So that was kind of neat. Um, this door would go to like um, a shared space because this is a rental building so we are going to be living downstairs and when we officially own we'll be renting out the upstairs so that goes into a common area and then through the back door. And then now we're back into our kitchen. Kitchen dining. And then this is a little hallway. It's actually a really big space, which is kind of nice because there was enough room to have the washer and dryer be hooked up over here. Which again, real life, this is some dirty laundry. I know, so exciting. All of Nick's like office-y computer stuff. I still have to empty those boxes just onto that bookshelf. So maybe today. And then right across from the washer and dryer is our bathroom.
So toilet's really close over here. Then Mickey and Minnie's shower curtain. And the vanity medicine cabinet. All of my bathroom stuff because our bathroom before had a lot more storage. Like significantly more. And then back into this office -y space and laundry room. This over here is our bedroom. <clears throat> so we haven't built our bed frame yet because it was actually my friend's and she just gave it to us. So thanks again so much Mercedes. And then a quick span through the space. This room is really big. It's the, like the same size as the living room which is really nice. And our bed and then we have a small closet over there which I'm going to put curtains up I just had them in the washer when Nick was helping me today the rod is up and the curtains are out but my tall person is not home <laughs> and then those boxes which I'm not really sure where they're gonna go I'm hoping that there'll be enough room for some of that on the bookshelf and then dinos following trying to figure out what's going on here Okay, now we're heading back out of this room. Back into the laundry room office area. And this is going to be Amelia's room. And this is the only room that we haven't done anything in. So, remember guys, we're all friends. We all know how much moving is not a blast. The space is 0% done. It was just everything that was hers. We put her name on and put in this room. <laughs> and eventually, when everything is done within a couple months, hopefully only a month, six weeks stops, I will do a nursery tour as well. So that is my new house. So now that you've seen the house, I thought I would give a little life update, I guess, at the end of this video. The reason or the reasons why we're not officially unpacked and moved in before I'm even showing you this. Sheesh. What was a big yawn? Is this little boy was very naughty a couple days ago and got into some stuff that he should not have. And we had to go get his uh, stomach. Not pumped, um, where they made him need to throw up because he got a hold of 10 pair, oh uh, no, not 10 pairs, 10 individual uh, earplugs, foam earplugs. And with how small he is, if they expanded, he wouldn't have been able to pass them. So that was fun at like 1 a.m to deal with that so then that next day was kind of a wash because we were both so tired and then the first issue so this was a couple days ago this was like last week we got our washer and dryer all hooked up and when we hooked it up it sounded like everything was fine there was no issues we waited for like half of the washer cycle to be done and then we went and ran an errand when it finished it apparently was too much water for the old pipes to uh, drain all at once so it backed up into my shower all over my bathroom floor so again that was fun that was like another 10 hour adventure for us very close to midnight by the time we were done, it was like 12.30. So the, again, so much fun dealing with that. But it's all done now. And we're most of the way moved in. So within a few more days, we should be all set. But that was our moving adventure. So we wanted to share it with you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. And uh subscribe if you're interested to see how the rest of the house turns out when it's more officially done like the nursery <laughs>